just an energy that just drives him to a higher level. Coach Dennis Shaver would love to see Terrence Laird repeat his SEC victory here over the 10 points, coupled with the 20 that Javon Harrison just gave them from the high jump and the long jump. They just don't have to have nearly the depth at the national championship level they have had at the conference level, so you can get a bunch of winners or top three placers. Those points add up very quickly. So many coaches say that they set up better for the national meet than the conference meet. On the inside, it's Harding, then Laird, then Zach Shinnick, 4x4 four four runner for USC, and 5, Robert Gregory of TCU out in lane 6. Laird just loading there in lane 4. Harding looking really hard in 3. Laird driving hard to the finish. Unofficially 2048, 2049 corrected, so he equals the time from Matt Bowling in heat number two. Although they're running in lane number four, they should improve upon that lane draw. Well, and you see there's an absolute skill to running these turns. Terrence Flair really works on his turnover in the turns, and then he tries to open it up on the straight. I saw him make adjustments coming off that, coming off the second turn down the back straight, and the same thing on that turn. Because he's on an inside lane, he has to really be conscious where he's at in that lane. He turned it over nice and quick. He waited to the straight, and then he let himself